West were a team that played in the Premier League last year, so for you to come up from League One and to put in a performance like that and get a win like that must be pretty special. Yeah, um, for us to come away from home, you know, back to back, you know, Wednesday and now tonight and grind out 1-0 wins, it's um, a sign of a good team. You know, um, we come here tonight, we stuck to our principles, t- stuck to our, you know, disciplined shape and we knew that we could hurt them if, if we uh, shut up shop and that was the, that was the end result. Yeah, I mean, you watched that game a little bit, I think, on Friday night uh, when they lost 4-1 here yeah. to Leicester. Did that kind of translate to what you expected to, from them tonight? Uh, well, we, you know, their managers obviously been at MK Dons and Swansea and, and now obviously Southampton, so we knew that, you know, the structures and, and the way that they play were going to be very similar to those, so we knew, you know, the very possession-based team, you know, you got players rolling in, you know, Fullbacks rolling into midfield, so we knew that blocking the middle and not letting any passes through the middle of us would be very key tonight. So we tried to make sure that everything sort of went down the sides and we could defend from there. And I think we've done that, you know, for the whole game. And when you keep clean sheets and you've got the quality that we have up front, we're always going to, you know, have a chance of winning. Mm. Goal comes, I guess, a little bit against the run of play. Obviously, they've had some good chances there, but I mean, a fantastic moment on his first starts for uh, Amari Hutchinson. Yeah, really, really proud for him. Um, you know he's come in from from Chelsea and he's you know he's got his head down and he's worked his socked off and um, he deserves his start tonight and he deserves his goal. Um, you know it topped off a, a brilliant away performance. Yeah, it was quite something kind of how you switched that momentum, wasn't it? Because it did maybe feel like they were starting to put the pressure on, and all of a sudden you get the goal and it felt like really you could have got another two or three of them. I think there's a a misconception where when a team has a lot of possession that it feels like we're under the cosh and things like that, but. It's very different when you're out there, when you know sort of we've got such a strong, disciplined shape that we knew exactly what they were going to do before they were doing it. So it's easy to sort of read where passes were going. You saw a lot of the time they were just kicking balls away, kicking them straight to us or kicking it off the field because, you know, we're shutting angles that we know that they want to play. And I think the goal comes from a brilliant press and a brilliant, you know, disciplined press and that we could have had a couple more off the back of it. Yeah, and I mean, it was kind of going into the international break, it was maybe less from the really strong defensive performances to conceding a few sloppy ones, yeah. individual mistakes. You had a clean sheet on Saturday, another one today, this one really impressive. Yeah. That feels like you're just making such big strides. Yeah, I think, you know, we're all human, so, you know, human error is always going to be a part of football. And I know, like you said, there was a couple sloppy mistakes for goals um, before the international break, but I think. It's you know, part and parcel of football, you're going to make mistakes and, you know, we're in the championship now and there's a lot of high quality players. So, you know, we probably would have got away with a few of them last year, but, you know, this year we we can't. And uh, I think, if anything, it's it's taught us a lesson in terms of, you know, we have to be switched on mentally for a lot longer. Mm, how's your hamstring now? Yeah, fine. All good. All good. And let's talk about that tackle then to finish with. I mean, <laughs> it was quite a nice one where you just ran back. It almost came from nothing. Yeah. Flew in almost kind of two feet up. Could have been quite a nasty one if you missed time that we got a spot on. Um, yeah, I mean, to be fair, it's not my art of, of the game, <laughs> to be fair, tackling. So, yeah, you're lucky I, I did time it quite well. But um, it's one of those ones, It's even if I don't win the ball, it's probably a good professional foul because they were breaking through the field. So it's one of those ones where if I don't get it right, I take one for the team. So it's all right, it's all right.